All right, welcome to a, another bonus episode of Dissecting the Frogs. I'm your host, David Bowden, joined here um, by Colin Salter from Cedar Hill High School, the latest commit uh, to TCU, a uh, linebacker. Uh, we're, we're all fired up here at, in Frog Nation. Excited for you. And uh, so welcome to the show. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> Um, I know it's an exciting time. You just announced your commitment and, uh, you know, we're, we want to make sure that uh, we welcome you here and, and talk a little bit. Tell me, you know, you got a, obviously a lot of opportunities. Um, why TCU, for, at the end of the day, why TCU, TCU for you? And TCU, I recently tore my ACL and TCU has been they know me ever since I called them and let them know that tough is going to recruit me hard because my honesty let them know, call them after it happened. Uh, that coach is texting me every single day, encouraging messages, telling me to wake up, go get to work. Since I'm just not coming off the surgery, like getting up, getting to work. Uh, have a good relationship with every coach on the staff, especially Coach Gillespie and Coach Jones, he a graduate assistant. They just uh, let me know to never give up, they're not giving up on me, and let me know they really want me. Awesome, man, man that's, that's great. I'll tell you, that, that goes a long way. Um, and you mentioned Coach Gillespie. Um, tell me a little bit because his defense is, you know, it's a three-three, uh, the three-three stack, and, and different than your four-down at Cedar Hill. Um, talk to me a little bit about what he's talk, told you in terms of how you fit into his defense. Uh, with me watching the film, I know that as a linebacker and trying to get used to their defense, I know I wouldn't be able to do a lot of thinking about what I do. I had to just either fill the hole or go straight into coverage. And I mostly like the defense because I wouldn't have to do a lot of thinking. For, for you, you know, I, I know it's your brother, your older brother, Caden, was a big time quarterback recruit and, um, you know, went to Tennessee, he's now at Liberty. Um, so he's, he's been through it a lot. You know, what did you take from that, you know, in your watching his process? I know quarterbacks are a little bit different in terms of recruiting, but what you take from it, learning from his his recruiting process um, to apply it to, to your own? I haven't been on a, a best college business with him and the worst college business with him. Uh, I know how how a coach would treat you if they really want you. And yeah, yeah no, that's good. I, I think you, you know you're right on, man. Um, if what you're saying is exactly right. Don't don't worry about this. Um, it, you know, you learn from seeing you know what worked from him and what didn't, and, and kind of seeing what's genuine, right? Like you know, you know when when this uh, yeah, I, I think there's a lot to be said for that. You learn. Uh, Cause everyone, you know, you go through it for the first time, um, you don't know what to look for, right? And so you're, I'm sure just, you know, kind of tag along with your brother and seeing it and it, firsthand, you already kind of had a, a practice round almost, right? And see kind of who was real and, and who wasn't for all that stuff, right? Yeah, no, that's good. New um, yeah, yeah, for sure, absolutely. Well, look, you, you're uh, you're one heck of a player. I know this is an exciting time for you and your family, and it's pretty neat that you can stay home in DFW, and and uh, I'm sure you'll have a lot of the Salters and more at uh, at games in Fort Worth. Um, so uh, we're all fired up for you and excited. And if you're ever in town, uh, make sure you know stop by. We've got a brand new studio uh, at Frogs today. It's at uh, Roxo Media House uh, right next to campus, and I uh, would love to have you there anytime. Uh, you know, come check it out for sure. And, um, you know, been, I've been a fan of yours and, and watching you for a long time and, and being in the DFW area myself and, um, you know, have always done things the right way and one heck of a player. I think it's I think it's really great that the coaches, you know, still continue to recruit you and know that you're potential, even though you've had a setback. I think that says a lot about them and it says a lot about you and your character. So congratulations. <laughs>